Hello and welcome to another video of Power BI beginner series and in this video we are going to discuss two power query function pad start and pad end. So let jump into Power BI in, and I am directly going to Power Query where I am going to create custom column for pad start and pad end. Okay, let's understand this function. Sometimes what happens you get like I got these names. I want to put something at the start or I want to put something at the end. And I want that repetition to happen. Like even if it is two digit number or is it three digit number, I want it to that to work. So let me do something. Instead of first we will use this and then I'm going to go come back and you know create a table where we have different size of the names and then we will do it. So let's start begin with this one. So let's say pad start. Then I say the function is a text function, so I'll say text dot pad start, and this can happen sometime when you click. So then I give the column which is name. You need to give a text column. If you have a numeric column, first convert it into text and then give it. And then I need to give what how many characters? So I need three characters. Right now I'm not giving any character. Let's see what happens. So you can see there are space before it and so it means if when we don't give you will get space but we don't need space we need something like zero. So I go ahead and do zero here. Now I got the pad started with zero three characters. Now let's start let's try to check out pad end. So let's copy this code and we will go. We say yes and we create a new custom column and we say pad and paste it here and we say okay did not get copy so let's say pad text dot pad e and d name comma three comma zero okay there is a space in h you might be thinking why this is only giving two characters here now you can realize that there is a space here so that's why because of that space you are only getting two characters here it is actually having three characters one there is a space okay so now let's quickly create some data and see what happens when uh, we have more characters and then we different different size let's say uh, and then we would try to do this so I go to home and I say enter data and let's quickly enter let's say I want always to be three digits so let's say two digit this we will make three digit this let's me make one one digit this again let's say make two digit something like that we call it as data table and let's quickly try that out so I got this column so one formula only we are going to create this time. So I will say custom column and here we are going to say pad start text dot pad start comma zero comma 3 comma 0 double quotes 0 so we got now all the number which are three digits so in this manner you can try out these function pad start and pad end, pad end. do let us know what else you want us to cover in this particular series thanks for watching this video thank you